I usually call this a um, two peg bind off. You skip the first peg, go on to the second peg, take it off your hook, place it onto the first peg that we ignored. And then we're going to knit off like so. So we have yarn on one peg, second peg is empty. We're going to take the, the yarn or the loop that's off the first peg and place it back onto the second peg. There we go. Do it onto the next one. Take your loop off. Place it onto the first peg. Like so. Yarn off. Like that. Take it off this peg. Place it on this peg here that we emptied. Do the same thing for the next one. Take it off, place it on. This can also be done with the with the flat rake loom as well. It's not necessarily for a circular loom. There we go. Continue on. Take it off. Put it on, knit off, like so, place it on, use your fingers or your hook, whatever you feel more comfortable, since I don't have any nails, I like to use my hook to assist me here. Take off the loop, place it on the first one. Like so, yarn off. Take that off, place it on. There we go. Do the same thing with the next one. Place it back on. Do the same thing. Run over. Take this. Place it on. Take it off. Put it back on. Yarn over, like so, take it off, place it on the next one, Take this off, put this on. Yarn over. Place it on peg. You can do it with your hook or your fingers. It's a little bit tedious, but it gives you a nice clean edge. 
at the end of your work. You can also check out my other video, cast off with a co or crochet cast off as well. It's another method of um, casting off. Okay, I'm having a hard time here. There we go. My other little guy here does not want to go on. I'll help it with my nail. And do the same thing. Continue onward. Knit off. Carry this loop onto the empty peg. There we go. Unhook this one, place it onto the first one. Yarn over this loop, place it on. There we go. Take it off, put it on. Yarn over, take this off. Place it on. We're almost to the end here. Do the same thing. Yarn over. Place the hook, the loop on that peg. And basically, what I do is I yarn over like that. Then I just remove. Remove this here. Like that. Get my scissors. I leave a long tail. It depends on what you do, but for this purpose, I'm going to leave a short tail. And basically, I feed the yarn through the loop like so and I yank on it and I create a knot so this is how you do a two peg bind off on a piece or on a project